I'm using 200 grams of sabudana. Rinse them with water twice. Following this, we'll rinse off the extra starch. Now add water at the neck level of sabudana and soak it for 2 to 3 hours. After 3 hours, you can see our sabudana is fluffy, non sticky, and smooth. Heat a pan and add 1 tablespoon of oil along with 1 fourth cup of peanut. Once the peanuts are fried well, pound them into a coarsely powder. Now melt 2 tablespoons of ghee and add 1 tablespoon of jeera. Add 1 medium sized chopped potato and saute them for about 2 to 3 minutes until the potato is soft. Sprinkle a pinch of salt and add few curry leaves along with 4 green chilies which are chopped fine. I am adding one dry chilli, it is not mandate, it is just optional. Add soaked sabo dana and mix everything well. Now add half a tablespoon of salt and saute them for a minute. Add the grounded peanut powder now and mix everything well and cook for at least 2-3 to three minutes on a medium flame. Finally add chopped coriander leaves, mix everything well and allow it to settle for a minute. Our sabudana kichdi is now ready. Hope you all enjoyed this recipe and do not forget to subscribe to Sasti Cooking for more interesting videos. See you in the next video with another recipe. Until then, happy cooking!